Also, a tornado also already hit here back in like 2005. So <laughs> uh, it's not impossible um, that we live in a tornado uh, territory. Holy jeez. The uh, alarm on my phone just went off uh, about a tornado. Hey everyone, welcome to the Hollowby Homestead. If you are new to our channel, uh, we are homesteaders uh, documenting um, our journey right from the beginning in Ontario, Canada. We've had a lot of rain. Kind of the upside of that is that you don't have to water your garden so much. Uh, because of the rain, uh, I've been uh, working hard at trying to um, get the garden weeded and, uh, you know, that's like a never-ending job. We've had kind of a uh, random week. Um, we've been uh, going for rides on the side by side on uh, nice days. <laughs> Are you testing the G forces? Yeah. <laughs> She's on. <laughs> I don't know. There's something in my eye now. Ah. Mm. I'm not joking. Uh oh. It's like, I want to go with yeah. you. That's for pigs. I don't think she's a fan. <laughs> I like you. <laughs> You're a dinosaur. You're a dinosaur. Look at her spikes. Mini Dino. You a dinosaur. Like, look at those fucking talons. Look at that drumstick. <laughs> <laughs> Cole always takes the obvious. Get some KFC spices on there. Mm. Hey, <laughs> Chicken pot pie. Neat when you move them, their heads stay still. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> yeah, you don't even have to duck.
Yeah, this one is like the nosiest. Oh my gosh. Offended. <laughs> oh, oh. oh, Johnny Cash. And, and Hennifer. Been uh, working around the yard and in the garden and uh, moving the chickens as usual. And uh, I don't know if you can see the chickens or roosters out there. Uh, there's a couple of roosters um, or suspected roosters um, in our um, chicken tractor that the hens are in. Uh, but I'm not like 100% so I'm just going to wait until they're a little bit bigger. We had a tornado warning earlier in the week. Hey, so it's a little early, it's just after five o'clock. I'm deciding that I'm gonna put the chickens in because I just found out that a tornado uh, touched down in Barrie, um, which was, which is, you know, like a couple hours from here, but still, uh, the skies are getting a bit moody and the wind is picking up, so I do not want to take any chances. It's starting to rain. I don't want to try and put the uh, chickens away uh, in a crazy storm. So here we go. Okay, the roosters are in. Now to put the other ones away. Uh, it started thundering here, actually. I'm a bit concerned. It's been kind of unsettled all day. And uh, I just uh, don't want to be trying to do the end of the day chores in a terrible storm. We're supposed to have uh, hail. And uh, also a tornado also already hit here back in like 2005. So uh, it's not impossible um, that we live in uh, tornado uh, territory. So anyways, I'm gonna put these guys away. All chickens go to bed. 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 Come on. All chickens go to bed. All chickens go to bed. All chickens go to bed. All chickens go to bed, Carol. Come on. Come on, Carol. All chickens go to bed. 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 Come on. All chickens go to bed. All chickens go to bed. All chickens go to bed. <laughs> Holy jeez. The uh, alarm on my phone just went off uh, about a tornado. So I'm glad it came out here. And uh, we just got a few chickens left. Come on, Carol. Carol's always the last one. Come on, bud. All chickens go to bed. All chickens go to bed. Come on, all chickens go to bed. All chickens go to bed. Come on, all chickens go to bed. All chickens go to bed. There we go. That's everybody. I really hope that I'm just overreacting. I would not be that happy if a tornado rolled through here. Uh, I think, I think that's all I need to worry about right now. Dave isn't even home yet. He's due home anytime. time. 
So for those who are not on municipal services like uh, sewage and water, um, so like you have a well, um, you, basically your power goes out unless you have a backup, which unfortunately we don't. Um, you have no way to flush your toilet. And uh, we learned this the hard way when we lost power for like, oh, it was like two or three days. And uh, if you can't flush your toilet, um, not to get personal, but it's a real problem. Um, so anyways, hot tip of the day. So I fill up this bucket and then um, if uh, the power goes out, if we need to use the toilet, um, we just pour it and the toilet will flush. And it's uh, it's quite a big bucket with two separate sections in it, so it holds a lot of water. So I'm just going to fill it up now, and then if the power goes out, we'll be okay. Thankfully, um, we did not get a tornado, although um, a town, or should I say a city, uh, a couple hours uh, just passed us, uh, did get hit, and there was some damage, so, uh, but thankfully nobody was killed, and, um, but yeah, we were very lucky that um, a tornado didn't actually uh, come down here. Well, it's raining, and I'm getting soaked. And I'm very happy about this. Uh, it is very hot out. And finally, the heat broke with some rain. And so I'm not complaining. So this next part of the video is probably a little gross, so um, 
avert your eyes uh, if you uh, get queasy easily. But uh, anyways, Cole, um, when she was coming out here, she found uh, a porcupine that had been hit by a car on the side of the road and she wanted to go check it out. And the reason she wanted to go check it out um, is uh, because uh, she makes beadwork and uh, quill work, so like uh, traditional uh, native crafts. And so one of the ways to get quills, um, instead of, uh, you know, going out there and killing a porcupine, um, you just look for them uh, on the side of the road. And so anyways, she really wanted to get some quills off this porcupine. So, um, here's the, uh, clips of that. So just be forewarned, uh, if you're a little queasy, um, don't watch this part. <laughs> you still want it? You gonna, you gonna make some nice, uh, quilt work there? Does it? Because, but look at this, foot blew off. I don't think it's good, man. It's got some meat. Pull on a quill and see if it's a... Uh... I'm afraid. Well, it's already exploded. <laughs> well, do you want them? You don't even have a container to put them in, man. Ew, hunt down wind, man. Oh, somebody's coming. <laughs> <laughs> the locals are like, what is wrong with these people? <laughs> is there a bag this is some traditional native gathering. <laughs> Most valuable roadkill on earth. <laughs> and uh, Jesse uh, came out last night and uh, had a little birthday celebration and um, she's working on a uh, river cruise boat so she doesn't uh, get off the boat often but uh, the, her schedule lined up and it was her birthday so uh, we had a little uh, birthday celebration for her sorry there's no candle <laughs> Hell you. Hell you. Hell you. happy birthday, birthday to you, you. Happy birthday, dear Jessie! <laughs> Happy birthday to you! Yeah. Woo! <laughs> chug, chug, chug! <laughs> Shots? <laughs> well, guys, I hope you enjoyed our kind of random put together video. Um, it's uh, kind of in a. Um, I guess you could say a random week um some weird weather and uh so just those uh clips are just from uh over the last few days and uh so i'm just kind of making uh these little clips now to try to uh explain where they all fit in and uh but anyways i'm going to end this video but before i end this video um i am going to give you guys um a bit of a sneak peek of an upcoming video that's going to be made 
uh, probably in two or three weeks. Um, so a few days ago, we went over to our friend and neighbor's uh, farm, and she's a market gardener, and she sells uh, garlic and, and lots of other things, but garlic is kind of her main thing. And uh, so I'm going to give you a little sn uh, sneak peek here. Um, so we went over there uh, to do some drone footage for her and uh, um, of her garden and of her property so she could have um, pictures and video um, of, uh, of her crop. And um, while we were there, uh, she let Dave um, try out her tractor. And uh, so uh, we are considering uh, getting a tractor in the future. Um, and she has a, a perfect size tractor and, um, she let Dave, uh, try it out while they were, uh, gathering up the garlic. And, um, I think he had a little too much fun. Anyways, uh, I'm going to, um, cut to that, uh, those clips, but, um, and then after that, the video is going to end. So watch for, um, the full episode of us over at, uh, Ellie's and, um, enjoy these clips. Ha, ha, ha. 